You got to grow. Otherwise, you become complacent. You stay in the same spot your whole life, and you're wasting your life. They all want to be the best like me, but they ain't never spit it this fresh like me. And they ain't never did it for the West like me, but yet they all trying to be just like me. Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Curtis B, and I'm back with another reaction video. If you have not yet subscribed to this channel, please just take one second to click that subscribe button down there. Also, hit that bell icon. Get notified when I upload new videos. Also, one more thing. Take another second to give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. Comment below. Let me know what you want to see me react to next. I'm excited about this one because right now I'm about to react to a new video by Token posted two days ago called Homies. Man. Eraser Shavings is one of my favorite hip-hop albums of all time, so I rock with Token, man. He's always coming with some fire. That's why I'm excited about this video. I haven't heard this song yet, haven't seen the video yet, and I'm ready for it. Let's get into it. I haven't heard uh, any of Token's new stuff in a while. Not saying that he hasn't put out any music lately. I personally just haven't listened to him in a while. Uh, I've explained this before where I find like a heart, a hip hop artist that I really like and I'll rock with them like hardcore like for a while. Like just listen to them. Then I move on to somebody else. Not that I'm not their fan anymore. I'll always be a fan of them. It's just that I like to expand. I like to find new artists. So I rock with this artist. Then I'm rock with this artist then i rock with this artist token i was rocking with him for a long time just haven't listened to a lot of him lately that's why i'm really excited to hear some new music from him yeah yeah hey this one you know what just off of the first impressions just from the way the beat's going i can tell Hopefully, I'm right about this. This is this is going to be one of those laid back token speaking on some really deep shit kind of songs cuz he has those type of songs and I really like that. Then he has the other songs where he's just fucking, you know, chopper flow, getting it, getting it, getting it, hyped up type shit. But this is one of those you're going to have to pay attention to what he's saying to really, you know, understand what he's feeling, what he's trying to say. Where did all the homies go? Oh man, yeah, this beat's dope. He's living a different lifestyle now. I'ma move to Marblehead, my heart was still in Salem. Whole new world, you're the one who made me feel welcome. Introduce me to the homies. Kicked it in your room, high ceilings, two parents. It was all something new. Uh, you found my <laughs> it's, it's weird seeing him as a kid, like a little kid, because I don't know. You, you when you have like a a person that you pay a lot of attention to, whether it be a music artist or an actor or whatever, you only pay attention to when you find out about that person. Up until you know recent times, you don't usually go back and dig try to find pictures of them when they were kids and shit like that you know and so i've never seen token this young so it's always weird when you see somebody that you pay so much attention to in a different light that you've never seen before it's cool it's just kind of weird i just thought i put that out there parents it was all something new you found my music you're the one who put it out only one i have my back when all them kids would joke around i started touring when you went to college we had different plans now you only hit me up to say your roommate is a fan damn, damn. Where did all the go? Where did man that's crazy things change man and i guess it's a story for a lot of people that make it in the business the people around you start to change you know people that where your friends or you thought were your friends starting to turn into different people but it goes both ways because people that make it can change too so Fan, damn, i guess it's just whatever happens personally yeah 
Cause I've been so gone so far away When I come back I always say Where did all the homies go? It's dope Where did all the homies go? Hey, hey You took me in when I had nothing but a crazy dream Ten years older and you never brought up age to me mm. Free studio cause I ate off the dollar menu When you helped me become a person that people pay to see Woo. You were my manager DJ, you were the whole nine even a dad when I felt like I didn't know mine something mm. came between us ego cast that's deep man he really looked up to this dude so he took him in when he was 10 years old never even said you know like anything about his age because he already knew that he was dope or he had a passion for it he could tell it was real so he gave him free studio time he was his DJ his mentor a dad like figure he really looked up to this guy. Even a dad when I felt like I didn't know mine. Something came between us, ego cast or something else. Don't know what it is. I wonder when recording by myself. Damn, where did all the homies go? Man. Where did all the homies go? Sad. Where did all the homies go? But at the same time, where did all the homies go? Yeah. life, man. So gone so far. Life is constantly changing and you have to adapt with it. You got to grow. Otherwise, you become complacent. You stay in the same spot your whole life and you're wasting your life. You know, like things change. You grow, you adapt, you overcome obstacles. You become a better person because of stuff like this. When I come back, I always say, where did all the homies go? Where did all the homies go? Hey, break up, get back together, break up again, right? Every time I go on trip, that's when I trip, right? You said you don't want to talk to me when I'm lit, right? Hmm. I said I only want to talk to you when I'm lit. I did Ooh. you dirty, so dirty, you can forgive. I don't forgive. The only one I ever loved, and I ain't loved nothing since. Damn. Didn't listen when you told me money doesn't make me rich. I lost my best friend. I ain't lose some chick, man. Where did all the homies go? Damn. Yeah, this is deep. I love when artists do stuff like this because, man, as an, a music artist myself, I can relate. Like, it takes a lot of courage to take what you are feeling, put it in a song, and then put it out there for potentially millions of people to hear. It's, it's awesome when they do this just because it's so courageous and relatable because everybody goes through problems like this you know like everybody loves to hear rap now and then where it's you know hyped up shit you want to party sometimes you want to you know you want to pour some drink or whatever you want to party you want to you know get money this and that that's all cool and everything if you just want to have a good time but this is important too man like this is hip-hop shit it's reaching deep within yourself and using your art to relate to other people. Token's really good at that. I like Token a lot. He's dope. What would be interesting, though, is if we could hear these people's side of the story, the ones that he's talking about. Because there's always two sides to every story. You guys have all heard that, right? Not saying that, you know, token side is wrong or anything. It's just that's his side of the story, which is great and everything. But it's always, I don't know, I'd be curious to hear what these people are saying. Like, how was token acting? How were, you know, from their point of view? Because he's talking about how things changed from his point of view. It'd be pretty tight to hear what, you know. I don't know. I'm just going off on a tangent. Sorry, guys. Anyways, token, homies. That shit was tight. Um, in my opinion, I basically analyzed the video while it was playing. So basically, my closure would be like, yes, token's great. I love how he can do this uh, laid back beat, reach deep into your feelings and talk about real shit type of vibe because he can obviously do the fucking chopper flow. He's dope at that shit. Don't get me wrong. But I love this token. This is awesome. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think of Token's video. Did you like it? Do Which Token do you like better? Um, are there any more Token videos you want to see me react to? Leave a comment below. Let me know. What would you think of my video? Let me know. 
like I said at the beginning, leave this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate it. I am so close to 1,000 subscribers, and I've been working hard to get there. I appreciate everybody who's supporting me right now for real. Salute to you guys, man. You guys deserve a shout out every single video, man. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good one, everybody. Peace out.